Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Kobayashi's Dragon Maid Season 2 Episode 6. I do not have anything saved for the start of the episode, so that is that. As always guys, like the video if you liked the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. We are very much nearing uh, the 1000 subscriber mark now. We've just passed 900 subscribers a few days ago. Really, really, really excited for it to hit this milestone for my channel. Um, but that is that, so let's go into this episode right now. <laughs> What the hell is he doing? Jesus Christ. I thought the clothes were part of the scales or something. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> like she's going to be scared by a dog. <laughs> He's not going to attack her. I don't feel like getting a drunk's a very good idea. <laughs> yeah, she obviously respects him, but it's just, it's, uh, you know, in an unusual way. Oh, she really does like being around him. Oh, Luca. Oh, and she trusts him and is able to live in his home. Oh. <laughs> So cute. <laughs> Dude, you are a child. <laughs> he doesn't want to be away from his fucking PC or something. They're gonna, he's going to think that he's your partner or something. Your PC will not last lo that long, my friend. <laughs> Everybody's trying to find out the dragon's weaknesses from Toru this episode. Yeah, okay, because that's going to work. I don't think that's going to work. <laughs> oh, some more cool dragon animation. Let's go. Oh my god, she's gone. Will your skills as a mage be able to help in this situation? Let's see. <laughs> yeah, everybody's afraid of Fafnir. Understandable. Oh? Bro, is he actually going to form a pact of Fafnir? What, did, what does this mean, though? What does this entail? <laughs> He's an otaku. <laughs> How do you even do it, though? Yeah, I don't know if Fafnir would like it, to be honest. Of course, of course he didn't actually want a Master 7 kind of relationship with him. That explains a lot with uh, Luca. <laughs> yeah. Terry is so happy to be here. And they all they all do enjoy their time here and they do enjoy acting as humans. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> He's got into attacking mode. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm not actually that cool. I'm a fucking nerd. <laughs> what if Kana takes her in her dragon form? Oh, Kana's so cute. Kana and Psycho are day out. So cute. They're so young, though. I wasn't allowed out, like, on my own until I was, like, 10, at least. <laughs> if you fall, you're dead. Oh, dead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Alright, local crazy dude just took the football. Cool. Oh, little dragon sausages. Yes, kind of eating things. I love it. <laughs> of course she has spurs. <laughs> Potato straws. The hell are potato straws? Who's gonna let go first? Definitely not Kana. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> this girl is way too in love with Kana, bro. <laughs> yeah, she has a different image in mind. 
Um, is this the first time of her seeing a dragon? Oh no! <laughs> My god, was that her first time of seeing a dragon? I'm not sure. Hey, old people that know how to use phones. Woo! <laughs> oh, <laughs> old people facts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she didn't get a picture of the monster, though. That was CG. <laughs> yeah, it was Pokemon Go. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Love the canon knows what that is. All right, so that was Kobayashi's Dragon Maid Season 2, Episode 6. Uh, really nice little episode right there. Uh, obviously, focusing more on the people who haven't had much time in this season so far, like Shota, Luka, Fafnir, Makoto, and uh, Rika, and Kana, which is really nice. We're at the halfway point through the season now, I believe. I think it's a 12-episode or 13-episode season. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, really nice little wholesome episode, as always. Uh, nothing too you know, story driven, but that's, you know, how it is. Um, but yeah, that's all I really have to say. And that is that. So anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.